Now you've seen plenty of the guys beat each other up tonight. Are you guys ready for some women's wrestling action? The next contest is a Maximum Assault Women's Division match. And it is under Triple Threat Rules. Introducing first. Powerful. 
a woman. Side headlock by the Queen Incarnate, Sahara 7 from Cairo, Egypt. Oh, look at that. Hey, shake that booty. Oh, she uses a weapon. A big booty weapon there by uh, Faye Jackson. Headlock, hip throw and a takedown. Faye Jackson on top of Sahara 7. Now 7 now with the head scissors. Where's Avarice at? She's taking a nap. At I'll, be a while. I'll, I'll get in the ring with the Queen if she'll put me in those head scissors. Yeah. women work out on their legs. Uh, they, they can put a hurting on you with those legs. That may be, but I enjoy every minute of it. Oh, another booty bump by Faye Jackson. What a weapon for Faye Jackson. Oh, kick to the bread basket. Oh, kick upside the head. by a big roundhouse right in the face. Oh, there's Abra. She woke, woke up from the dead there. Uh, this ain't an elimination match where it would do you well to you know, hide at ringside. Tony, what ball is that Alan Graves? That's right, Hudson. The first ball wins it all. Yeah, so it don't do you, don't do you any good to stay out there. Look at that dog. And Alan Graves, what a brute. He just hit a lovely lady. Oh, these fans are ready to raise the roof. I mean, what kind of a man hits a beautiful woman like that? First into the ring post. Lovely Sahara 7. Hey, I'm all about winning however you can. But when you lay your hands on a beautiful woman and hit her and beat her up like that, that's where Andy Howard can draw the line. This referee needs to get him out of here. Yeah, even you wouldn't stoop to that. Yeah. Now, Everett's not working over Faye Jackson. Sahara 7 might be done for the rest of this match. Thanks to Alan Graves. Like she don't get much sun. Look how pale she is. Oh, she's creepy. <laughs> Only a two con for Everest. Oh, and Alan Grace, he's, he's going after Sahara again. Oh, yeah, it's just despicable to hate. He's choking her out, I think. Trill Wizzy's three-way matchers, no DQ, no Connaughts. Everest gonna maneuver. And finally, the queen is back in the ring. I'm really surprised that uh, she can return after what she went through. That's why they call her the queen. Uh, she's still a lot worse for the wearer, nonetheless. Yeah, that beer she took to the outside of the ring, it's showing. She's out on her feet, that Sahara. Oh, still got enough to reverse. Oh, a knee upside the jaw. Oh, and a, another knee up to the jaw to Faye Jackson. A knee to Everest. They call that a shining wizard. What you gonna make her give her a knee? Oh, Sahara gives Faye Jackson a net breaker. And in turn, gives a, Faye Jackson gives a DDT to Avarice. The Queen took advantage of momentum right there. Looks like all three are knocked out now. That might have been Sahara's last gasp. We can't have a triple con out. Or a triple knockout. Got to have a winner here. Well, the Queen got a two count. She was the only one who was able to get up and up to her feet and at least set up after that. Oh, we got three uh, weary women in there now. But they're on their knees, throwing everything at each other, trading blows, all three of them. Hudson, did you just say, well, they're all on their knees and trading blows in the same sentence? I mean, this is a G-rated production, Hudson. I'm surprised. They're trading fistic blows. Nick, walk your minute. Oh, yeah. Now they're 
throwing their feet, throwing uh, everything at each other. Everything with the proverbial kitchen sink. All right, Everest whipped to the buckle. Sahara to the opposite. Oh, avalanche running squash. Another avalanche running squash. Oh. She's shaking that booty. Oh. She's wrapping it up. Is it going to be a cannonball or stink face time? Stink face. She's put that booty to use, backing it up. That bodacious booty of Faye Jackson used as a weapon. Oh, there's a Alan Graves in there. Oh, Faye Jackson gets him. Oh. She double spiked his head right in the mat. I hate to say it, but that man had a cover. And it looks like he's going to get some booty in his face. A lot of booty to go around from Faye Jackson. You got that right. She's a lot of woman. A lot of attractive woman. Voluptuous, I believe they call that. Yeah. She crushed the, the box of Avarice in the corner. Avarice done. And that's it. Faye Jackson with the winner with the big cannonball. Well, the queen didn't get the win here, and she's still my queen in my book. Stay tuned, there's still a few more amazing matches yet to come. 